Hey guys, it's me. I just went to Costco and I did a tiny little Costco haul. Yeah, not so tiny. But anyway, let me go ahead and just show you what I have. Bella, what are you doing? Bella! <laughs> there you are. You haven't been in a video in a while. She's got a little bone. Anyway, so let me go ahead and share what I did get. I paid $130 for all of this stuff. And yeah, there were some really great deals. So back here by Penny, she's being blocked. She can't get close to the food. <laughs> um, two gallons of milk. This was $5.19. So a little bit more expensive than I've seen it lately, but still a lot cheaper than at my grocery store. So about $2.60 a jug. So not too bad. I went ahead and picked up a rotisserie chicken. I'm going to go ahead and do my own cranberry pecan uh, celery chicken salad with that. So I'm going to shred that up later. Over here, I picked up some celery for that and just for snacking. Oh, this was $4.99 and this was, I think, $2.99. I got some broccoli for $3.99. I'm going to freeze some of it and use the rest with dinners. I got some craisins. They were doing samples of these and I haven't had them in a while. So I went ahead and got the big one. I usually get them at Trader Joe's, but these don't expire till next August. So I'm sure <laughs> they won't go bad and we'll use them all by then. So that's a really great deal. I think it was seven, gosh, seven forty. It was kind of a random price, but yeah. So that was a great deal. I went ahead, turned that around, and picked up some vanilla. We were out. It was like six something, almost seven dollars. So, pretty a pretty big bottle of it though. That'll be great for the holidays. A huge bag of frozen chicken. It is I think nineteen ninety nine, and there are how many pounds? Ten pounds. So. A lot of chicken that's really handy for us so we just used up our last bag from last time so got some more of that got some little clementine type little tiny oranges i think these were 5.99 and then i got one big thing of romaine hearts for 2.99 so as you can see you know you're you can't use coupons at costco and there are so many things at costco that i would never buy because i do coupon especially toiletries and you know, household products and things like that. But when it comes to produce and meats and cheeses and stuff, sometimes there are better, better deals there. So you just kind of have to watch out for them. For example, on this lettuce, $2.99 for all of that is a really great price, I feel. Uh, the broccoli is a really great deal. Um, even just like the chicken, this is cheaper than it would be at my grocery store. So yeah, there are some really great deals on some things that you might not always have coupons for. So yeah, kind of a random non-couponing video, but I wanted to go ahead and do a Costco haul. Oh, duh, I got a couple more things. What am I, what am I thinking? <laughs> I also picked up this bread, this torta bread, so that'll be great for the sandwiches. And the reason that it was so expensive, <laughs> you're probably like, how is that all just 130? Is because I also picked up some ink. And this is the first time I've bought ink at Costco. I found these extra large packs. This was $60, which ouch <laughs> hurts, but there are three of them and it says that they have up to twice as more than the regular. So essentially that would be $10 an ink cartridge, which to me, I think that's a pretty good deal. So I went ahead and just picked this up just so I wouldn't have to worry about ink for a while because as you know, if you coupon, we're printing things all the time. So yeah, that was really Ouch, the big one. And the rolls were, I think, $5.99 or something, $4.99. So anyway, I paid $70 on food, which isn't quite as bad. <laughs> so yeah, thanks guys for watching. I don't know if you can see Penny, but she's standing on the trash can. <laughs> what a little weirdo. All right, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I hope you're having a great week.